Hi, it's Jackie with Reborn Babies Are Forever Babies. And today in the nursery, I have just little Miss Julie. And Jewel has been playing very nicely by herself today. I did want to show you the new outfit that she's wearing. I had put it on her yesterday before the fiasco with the Cowboy and Indian episode. She decided that she would play by herself today and avoid the timeout chair altogether. So I'm going to start right up here at the top of her head and show you the beautiful white headband that she's wearing with the blue polka dots. It's gorgeous with her eyes. She does have a little white shell of a t-shirt on with puffy sleeves and that's because Jewel is three-quarter arm so she does need to have some type of a shirt on underneath anything that's sleeveless but that's all right because I found this and it looks perfect on her and I actually bought um, like five different colors to put underneath different outfits the little shell shirt is so adorable as you can see it's blue and white checked with a yellow ribbon with white polka dots and the daisies it's a really cute cute look for her yes sweetheart I'll tell them Jewel wants me to bring to your attention that she is playing with her little daisy duck today which is awfully appropriate seeing as she's wearing a little outfit with daisies on it. Now, Jewel's little outfit could be worn as a dress or she could wear it as a pantsuit like she has on today. The length is perfect though if we decided to put a little ruffle bottom on or a little pair of underpants. And her leggings are dark blue with the bell bottom ruffle. She has little white ruffle socks on and a really cute little pair of white sneakers with the T-straps to finish off the outfit beautifully. Now as you can see right here, this is what I use to um, have my baby hold little items in their hands. You know the little clear elastic bands that you use on braces or as hair ties? the little tiny ones. Well that's what I use for my babies so that they're able to hold different things and assume the position of playing. And as you can see it doesn't even show once you come to the other side. And I am able to set them up with props. I did that yesterday with the bow and arrow set and I bet you didn't even see them. Now depending on how heavy the object is, I may need to use between one and four elastics to hold the toy in place. And I actually use these little elastics on the tricycle to keep their hands on the handlebars. And I'll bet you never realized that they were even there. Now I have been waiting for little Jewel to take her first steps. Maybe today she'll take them. Maybe if I call her, she'll come to mommy. Jewel, sweetheart, come see mommy. Come on. Come on, pumpkin. Come see mommy. Come on. Come on. That a girl. You can do it. Come on, pumpkin. Come on. Oh, that's mommy's girl. Come on, sweetheart. Come on. A little further. Little further, pumpkin. Little baby girl's doing it all by herself today. So I'm glad you were all here to see Jewel take her first steps. Oh, that's it, baby girl. Come to mommy. Come on, sweetheart. A little further. Come on. That a girl. That a girl. Almost. A little further. Yay! She did it! She took her first steps. Good for you, sweetheart. Well, I want to thank you all for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Bye-bye!